I made a game also sorry it's been eight months development on this game actually began with one of my old projects so that's for us it's one of the actually good games that I've made which aren't a whole lot to be honest so I just wanted to expand upon it also one of the games that I've been playing lately is Ultra Kill pretty inspired to paint the skin by it. So first up, movement. I borrowed the movement controller from the Prawl, which is based on the Titanfall 2 movement. Adjusted to my needs of course. But movement alone isn't gonna get me far. I needed guns. And would you look at that? some perfectly delicious models free of charge. I implemented the first gun, a muckle. And I also got my hands on some hands because they're used for holding the stuff, which is pretty cool. It's also a gun, old fire, which looks sick. Then I made the first enemy, this guy. This is so boring for to kill, but don't tell me what, okay? Next enemy, Shooter Guy. He throws projectiles at you at close range. Not much else, to be honest. But something was missing here. Something deep was missing. Parrying. You can just chuck the projectiles back at them. This felt really cool. Also, forgot to mention of the sword that I added, which is maybe a tiny bit too OP. Next up, skull enemies. They swarm around you, not too interesting to be honest. And that's about it. But the weapon roster is looking kind of thin. It's only got one pistol after all, so rifle. Right. It just fires really quickly and with the old fire chucks grenades. Next up, shotgun. This functions like any old shotgun. And with the old fire you can throw the projectiles. These are actually really cool because you can parry your own projectiles, which disturbs a little bit of depth. I'm actually really proud of these animations because I'm not an animator. And these are pretty good for my standards at least, which doesn't say a whole lot now that I'm thinking about it. Thanks to Tasty Tony for all these weapon models, check them out on Sketchfab. And also the weapon sway script was literally generated by ChatGPT, so thanks ChatGPT. But this platform is starting to look a bit boring. We need level. So once you complete the first level, into the second. I mean, it's just a bunch of boxes, but I can't come up with anything better. All the textures are from CCO textures, by the way. A couple enemies here and there. And this boss, which looks like straight from the Mandela catalog. He just chucks a bunch of grenades at you, and he's actually pretty hard to be. And then we have the third level, which I think it's the best I've made. It starts off in this area, which has water underneath. Shoot a couple of bad guys. Get into the next wall run area. And kill these projectile guys, which actually look pretty hard. And then the end. Finally, the fourth level, which is just a bunch of floating platforms. And if you go to the back, Let's just, let's just ignore that and go further in the level and then you get to this bridge which collapses and I'm pretty proud of that effect even though it's just a bunch of rigid bodies slapped together. Also added some last post processing to make it look nice and I think I've made enough progress for now.
I'll very much still continue to work on this game and if you want to play this game then you can check the link in the description where you can play the demo version and so I have started a discord server please report the bugs if you experience them in the game and give feedback on how I can improve the game and new levels to add in the server it has currently no people in it but if you want to join then please do so if you would like to see me work on this game a bit more and finish it then please like and subscribe it really helps me out a lot and pushes this video and for now bye